Howdy Pards, Mr. Holster here. Just had a little coffee in the tack room this morning. Uh, it's shotgun season, so I'm getting my shotguns out, and I've decided I've been neglecting my shotguns ever since I got the Mossberg shockwaves. I've been carting those around here and really haven't been using my shotguns much. So... I, I started getting out the double barrels and getting them ready to use for the fall and cleaning them up because, yeah, I think I'll get them out and use them. It's the time of year. Also going to get down there, and and I was working on the skeet range the other day and kind of let the weeds grow up and stuff down there. It's, it's back in that woods... And the edge of that woods and the mosquitoes are just awful in there so i haven't been down there all year so i got in there and and getting it cleaned up so maybe i can do a little skeet shooting down there i don't know that i'd be able to hit anything with this with the coach gun but we may try it anyways actually this this shouldn't be that bad because it does have a uh, modified cylinder on it so that Bacal coach gun I have, that double barrel, that one's got uh, just cylinder boards on both sides. Interesting thing, though, you know, this is one of the reasons I like this gun so much. This happens to be a Rossi Overland 12-gauge. They made the Rossi Overlands in 12-gauge, uh, 20-gauge, and 410. This is the Overland coach gun. Made by Rossi, imported by Inner Arms. And I've had this for a number of years. This is probably made a good... Well, it's probably made in the, in the late 80s or mid 80s, I suppose. And actually used to use this for work. And I was fortunate enough to see on Midway USA... They had some frangible shotgun ammunition the other day. And fortunate for me, it was half price. So, I talked to Jack, and Jack said, why don't you get yourself a couple boxes and go down to the hard target range and see if you can do some damage to those steel hard targets by hard target. So I think we're going to be down there on the hard target range one of these days doing a little shotgun video. But till then, I'm going to get out on that skeet range and see if I can hit anything. I haven't been skeet shooting since uh, 1982. Yeah, that's a while ago, wasn't it? <laughs> a couple of years ago, 1982. So I thought I'd get it out and clean it up, and I got out that that Russian shotgun, too, and cleaned that up. But back to what I was saying, you know, the Russian shotgun, the interesting thing, these double barrels, as soon as you close the action, that Russian shotgun, it's cocked ready to go. It has a nice tang safety on it. But that's one of the reasons I really like the Rossies, and I have so many of these old Rossi Overland shotguns and used them so often, is because you have a hammer on there. You can load that thing, close it up, and you're not going to uh, do any damage if you pull the trigger because you got to cock it first. Yeah, because it's got hammers on it. One for, one for each barrel, just like the triggers. One for each barrel is a good double barrel shotgun should be. Well, I thought I'd share my Rossi Overland coach gun with you today. Just a, just a nice inexpensive old double barrel shotgun made by Rossi and imported by Inner Arms out of Virginia, the old Inner Arms. So there you go. Thanks for tuning in this morning, guys. Till next time, well, from Mr. Holster and Jack, go out and stay safe.